Hey guys, what's up? Lord Meacher again here, your lord of video games, and welcome to another episode of Persona 5 Royal. I will, I don't know why I almost said Persona 4. Oh my lord, this is 5, this is Persona 5. I've never even played the rest, how am I even confusing them? Anyway, last time, we actually had some difficult rejections, but uh, everybody knows the secret. We're maxing out confidence and everybody's knowing. And oh boy, uh, we are continuing off where well, last time we had uh, nothing to do. So, came up with what I'm gonna do today. Since there is absolutely nothing else we can do. Uh, let's see what's here for a second. I have a lot of these. Uh, maybe some more of this. That's fine, I have a lot of money. Even though we use a lot of money on personas. Uh, let's go to the batting area. You know, quick travel to the batting cages in Young and yeah, yeah. Hmm? Batting cages in a small place like this? What's it like inside? Let's take a look. I see. So they're doing this on the rooftop. Hmm? I've seen you here before. In case you didn't know, services here change depending on time of day. Okay. In the batting cages will cause time to pass, but you'll get prices based on your performance. Your proficiency will all increase. Okay. I can't even read. You'll face a total of five pitches. Hitting all five pitches will get you the slugger prize. If you hit a home run, you'll get home run prize. Okay. Activities available change according to the time of day. At night, there are no prizes, but you can swing as much as you want. Also, if you hit three home runs, you'll receive a coupon for a free daytime session. Oh, okay. Good prizes here during the day. Now there are no prizes, but you can play all you want. Okay. We hit three home runs. We have a free ticket to play during the day. Good deal, right? Want to give it a try? Sure. Let's play. And nothing else to do. Uh, beginner. Good luck. Hit three home runs. You get a free play ticket. Best of luck to you. Does this cause time pa time to pass? Just the angle of bat up or down to match the ball's trajectory. Back to trajectory, okay. The ball overlaps with the icon. Press the swing the bat, try to hit the target, okay. Okay. Oh. <laughs> there we go. Nice. Too early. Okay. Oh, so close. <laughs> ah, I did pretty good. Okay. Oh. Whoa! <sighs> Damn, nice. I missed. Oh, that should have okay. been a home run. Oh my lord. <laughs> I am sucking. There we go. Nice. Mm, that was close. Nice. So I can just keep going? Yes. Oh. Okay, let's stop. Wanna give it a try? You can swing all you want. Uh that's enough. Nice I think going. I took it out of the bomb. That's it! You totally got your right to the ball. You should try for that prize when we come back during the day. I get proficiency. I mean, everything is maxed. We finished adjusting to another machine by October, so there will be a new course added around it. Okay. Alright, let's head home. At least I got what a, se a sense of it. If I had... I hit three home runs. I could have gotten a free take. Oh, well, it's whatever. Yay, we're back to the normal uniforms. What do you think will happen to Akuma of Foods? Shucks. Well, the CEO has a change of heart. The company's image is still in ruins. I imagine their stocks plummeted. Do you think Akuma really exploited his employees? Their little rumor just viral these days. It was all just a lie. So, the real victims here are the employees themselves. 
Nah, the rumors about Akumara Foods were all well known in the industry. You're overthinking it. Yeah. <clears throat> What's happening at school? Hey, did you hear? S'mores meets went pretty great. Look, they overcame all the odds, made it to victory stand. It's like something out of a movie. Yeah, they put on a stellar performance this time. Must have been training really hard. I see more people with smiles on their faces now. Out of the way, bitches! I'm coming for my husband! You too. I don't care about you. Shut up! I'm going for my husband! Dude, the girl's pretty weird. She's always running after that dude. Yeah, I guess. She is pretty weird, but, you know, whatever, I guess. Yo, uh, you guys gonna keep talking? I'm kind of listening. Huh? Why are you listening to us? Uh, I wasn't talking to you. I'm on the phone. I'm on a Bluetooth headset. Oh, my, my apologies. Uh, my bad. Wait, you actually went to watch? Seriously? What you mean, though? Well, maybe I'll go cheer them on, too. But that was it. Just two more, par two more sentences. <laughs> okay, nothing in school. What is? Oh my God, that's a lot. Uh. Hmm. Let's spend some time with Shinya. But if I'm not mistaken, let's see. Komaruki. I can't go up with him, so... Mm. Let's go to Shinjuku. And let's actually, um... Try and get enough points for him. I keep forgetting to read that! Alright, uh, I like an affinity reading. Shinya. There he is. 5,000 yen is nothing to me now. Here we go. Alright. Can you imagine I'm gonna come out with 2 million yen one day? Hopefully, next palace or next time I go into Mementos. Because I did come out with. Uh, out of mementos with one million uh seven hundred thousand yen the first time all right now let's go to shinya now i wanted to go to the arcade ah, dumb. is this even worth it the capsule machines oh. uh let's do it might as well is this room decoration or deck pick up? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Uh, thieves Den update. Oh. oh, is this for the Thieves Den? If so, ooh. Mini Dominion. That's too bad. Oh. Oh, so this is what it is? Is it for the Thieves uh Huh. So, let me let me know what you guys think. Well, this I'll probably do this off screen because it doesn't seem that important. Ah, uh, where? Oh, here's the arcade. All right. Arcade Gigolo. All right. Hey, Shinya. It was a Phantom Thieves Castle toy. Okay, yeah. I think I want to keep today's training short. Is that okay? That's fine. Let's uh, study under him. Hey! After our training, I want to talk about the rumors surrounding Takekuma. Okay, sure. Hey! Can't yeah, stop thinking about my battle with Takekuma. I mean, I couldn't do anything to him. There's just no way. Hmm. Well, it's pretty weird. Even if he's a pro. Right? I need you to understand. I'm practicing a lot after all. And rumors about Takekuma. People say he uses cheat armor. 
No? You know what that is, right? You totally broke the rules by equipping it. I bet that's why when your shots didn't work against him. It has to be the reason. Mm. Is it? But next time we play, I'm definitely... All right. I'm definitely gonna demolish him. Mm. I'm sure you can do it. Yep, even the Fantasies had a comeback victory against Medjet. I'm gonna win next time. Just watch. Hey. I believe in you. The thing is, I told my mom about what happened with Takakuma, but... Mm -hmm. and she said she didn't really care. What she said was okay. It was probably because I lost. It's just like kids who lose. Mm -hmm. My mom once told me that. We just need to be strong, because it's just the two of us. She said no one helps the weak. We just get preyed on. Mm. That's why I want to get stronger. Strong enough that we won't get preyed on. Strong enough that we'd be the predators. That's exactly who the Phantom Thieves are. The strongest who can prey on anyone. Once I become the strongest, my mom will be able to count on me. That's the only way I can win is through games, so I can't lose. Uh, what should I do about Takekuma's armor? The strategy I used last time didn't work. Uh, I think you need a new strategy. That strategy, then. Of course, I'm definitely gonna win next time. Thanks. You're kind of like a big brother to me. I can uh. talk to you about anything. And that's what it's like to have a sibling. Hmm. She needs brotherly affection. Ah, that's sweet. Lace bullets increase the success rate of an ailment inflicting gunshot. Whoa. All right. Shinya taught us how to use lace bullets. That's kind of whoa. That's kind of good. Takuma better watch out. Ah. Crap, look at the time. I gotta go. Director Shinya has made my heart grow. I feel like my kindness has increased. You know, even though my knowledge and everything is maxed. Later. See you later. All right. Have a good one. Oh, Miyaki-san, I uh, appreciate your input on that issue today. Hey, I sound like a grown-up, huh? Yeah, my mom says that a lot on her conference calls. And Takakuma, even thinking about him pisses me off. I'll beat him next time for sure. But since he might be cheating, normal training isn't gonna cut it. I gotta think of a new strategy by the next time I challenge him. I'll be cheering you on. brother now huh. that's so nice ah you're back yes hey hey that broken laptop you might be able to fix it with the pc tool set but it this be a perfect project for fixing your at your work desk we should try when we got time actually Ooh. why is he available coming why is available Hmm. That's catchy. I'm starting to like uh go up a little bit more with BY, see what he gives me. Hopefully he gives me some good stuff. <sighs> hmm. Alright, let's see. I wanna work. Alright. Tell you about the shop. It's a piece of cake for a gun enthusiast like you, right? Yep. Let's go. What are you gonna do? Are you gonna hang out with VY? Yes, I will. <laughs> if you're considered an employee, you don't seem suspicious coming in and out of the shop, right? If you get what I'm saying, bring the goods into the back. 
Hmm. Hey. Hurry up and learn this stuff, kid. You gotta be able to start looking like a normal employee. It's supposed to be running an honorable business here, you know. Though, honestly, the customers have been running a little thin lately. Hmm? Some guy on the internet has been claiming all my goods not goods are knockoffs. Once you got a bad rap like that, it's real stuff to shake. Hmm. You know how that feels, man. <laughs> Kid like you. <laughs> Going through something similar? Yeah. Guess you wouldn't be doing any of this if you weren't, huh? Don't give me any details, though. I want to know. Anyway, I should probably fill you in on what's going on here, because you'll be helping me out. Bet anything the guy behind that room or Suda. Remember his name from the diner, yeah. Truth is, he's the second in command of the Hashiba clan. The same clan I was in back when I was part of the Yakuza. Hmm. I feel like this is the most. I was near you with Doug. <laughs> Got some nerve. Anyways, so that was my sworn brother back in the clan. Got some unsavory business going down with him now, though. Problem is, I'm a known quantity. I'm a known quantity in the underworld. One bad step, and I have guys crawling all over me. Hmm. That's why I got you around. You look normal, sure. They got balls, kid. Makes you prefer snooping on Suda. I hope I ain't scaring you off with all this talk. Hmm. We made a deal, didn't we? <laughs> <laughs> idiot. But you know, got a bit of sauce spot for idiots like you. Anyways, you got the gist of what's going on now, yeah? You'll be working with that in mind. Expect a lot, a lot from you, kid. You should be grateful. Oh, and I'll add to the menu, thanks. Thank you for getting that info for me the other day. Do you like my bomb view is growing even deeper? Perfect. Camo customization allows you to customize camouflage on your gun, which can inflict ailments. Huh. Can I stack the customizations? All right. UI has given you permission to use camouflage customization. Could I? Hello? What's the meaning huh? of this? Don't tell you to stop coming around here. But. Hmm. Is that one of your customers? <sighs> you keep your mouth shut. Say none of your business. Okay, my bad. Just go home and study, Koru. We got Entry Sam coming up, remember? Oh, that might be his kid, right? Okay. Yeah, I guess I'll be going then. Was that his kid? Yeah. That's Kaoru. My son. I knew it. He's always asking me if he can help out here. He's worrying about what I'm getting up to. I probably shouldn't be telling a kid like you about this. Well, you can head home for today. Nice work, kid. Ah, okay. Interesting. But he's a dad. This is Gun Dad. <laughs> okay, no, let's not go. See you next time. Eighty-nine. Eighty-nine. Let's go. We're almost at ninety. Wow. Can't wait for his public apology. I should execute everyone who causes trouble for society. Oh, maybe they could take down my boss. But just to knock the fan at these are just sore losers. What about a catchy coon? Is he too afraid of, of backlash to comment? Apparently. Well then. That reminds me! The home shopping program is airing today. You wanna check out the TV? Yes, but let me check something else. Hmm. Oh, I don't have hmm, let's decorate. Oh yeah, I don't. Hmm. Let's stop. Hmm. Let's check the home shopping channel. Hmm. 
Right. Pumpkin ghost set. Lantern necklace, pumpkin soup. Okay. Ghost repellent set. I think I'm gonna go with probably this one. Pumpkin go set. Let's hope it's worth it. Well then. Alright. Let's see. Anything to do today? No. Dr. Kim is maxed. Yusuke is maxed. We have a Kodo. That's it. We do have a Kodo. Hmm. So let's probably let's probably go with Makoto. Hey Makoto, you ready for a date? She can go up, right? Let me see. Yes, okay, perfect. All we can do now is wait. Oh yeah. Hey, do you have some time to talk about Eiko's boyfriend? I feel we become closer with Makoto thanks to the High Priestess Persona Kikurihime. Hope I will grow stronger soon. Yep. How it's going to be? You want to hang out with Makoto? Yes, I will. <laughs> Thank you. Well, let's meet in the front in the student council room. Hmm? Why? We take the back entrance to school. Oh, okay. This president breaking the rules. <sighs> Nico's boyfriend, Sukasa, has been sending me a lot of texts recently. Why? His days and nights are reversed due to his work, so he often sends me a good morning late at night. Does Aiko know about this? I'm not sure. I'd definitely tell Aiko if he asked me on a date. But for now, things are generally pretty normal. Mostly messages like, How's your boyfriend? And hope you had a great day today. Oh my god. Do you think their relation could actually be serious? Was I just biased to think that all he wants from Aiko is her money? Hmm. He's definitely a little suspicious, honestly. Yes. I mean, it does sound like a TV show. Line hose that tricks women into death and forces them to sell their bodies. Whoa. But those kind of things exist in reality as well. In moral hosts, human trafficking rings. My father even mentioned to me about gangs of men that look specifically for depressed women in Shinjuku. It seems... They take advantage of the loneliness in girls feel to force them into horribly abusive situations. Then after ensnaring Ensuring these the girls are buried in crippling debt, they make them sell their bodies to pay it off. Oh wow. In other ways they force girls into it as well. Blackmail, illegal immigration. There are countless victims of schemes like that. Countless gangs as well. My father was going after a particularly notorious one when mm. Kodo? What's wrong? In the course of investigation, he was hit by an errant truck. The impact killed him instantly. Oh. Kodo. <sighs> at first, it... At first it was thought to be an accident. But at the funeral, I heard my father's supervisor speaking with my sister. <laughs> they say my father had likely been assassinated. They suspected that the gang he was investigating hired the driver. Who was their leader? I don't know. The driver died on impact as well, but apparently they found drugs in his bloodstream. Either way, the gang has been pushed back into the shadows thanks to the Shinjuku cleanup operation. I'm not sure any of that would have happened if not for the incident with my father. He was a noble man. I'm not going to pry further. He truly was, wasn't he? Wish could be a little more like him myself. Instead, 
just become, been hesitant. That's actually why my sister became a prosecutor to begin with. She couldn't stand by and watch as evil prevailed over justice. That passion undoubtedly came from our father. Our mother passed away many years back, so when father was killed, we had to survive on our own. The responsibility, the pressure of that all fell on my sister. Because of that, she can't help but talk down on our father at times. She says death is no different than surrender, but it wasn't his fault. She's been carrying the burden so long. But... I still look up to him. I was often lonely because of how much time he spent at work. But seeing him entirely pursue one case after the next was nothing short of incredible. That was how my father chose to live his life, trying to make justice in order to the world around him. <sighs> I'm sure he was happy. Yes. Come to think of it, there was something he used to say to me all the time. The most important part of your life is how you choose to live it. How have I chosen to live? More importantly, how do I want to live? You can figure that out now, honestly. You're strong. I see. Now? You're right. I can still change my path going forward. To be honest, I've been determined to follow the path my sister laid for me. After my father's death, I wanted to lighten the burden on her as much as I possibly could. Uh, oh, we are supposed to be talking about Eiko here. Sorry for going off topic. Actually, you know, I've never actually talked to anyone about my father. It's such a painful memory to look back on. But I feel comfortable discussing it with you. And beyond that, I think I understand my life a bit better now. Thank you very much. So, thank you. You're welcome. I can sense a deep bond of trust for Makoto. Did you get anything new? Shadow Factorization. It allows you to see, no, repel, repel, and drain when highlighting a target in battle. Okay. Right. So, they'll tell me immediately. Okay. That's actually really good. Makoto can now use Shadow Factor. Shadow factorization. English is hard. Hmm? Oh, it's Echo floating again. Maybe I'll, like, skip college and just get married to Sukasa instead. Oh boy. I guess she's choosing how she wants to live too. As long as she's sure she'll be happy. Oh, another message. Huh? Serious about Miyake kun? Want to have a double wedding? Uh. I'm game if you are. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. I didn't even begin to think about marriage at this point in my life. Oh, damn it. <laughs> I tried. <laughs> By the way, can you keep pretending to be my boyfriend for a bit longer? It's the best method I have of keeping tabs on Eiko and Tsukasa. At any rate, thanks for listening to me today. I'll let you know if anything urgent comes up. Of course. All right then. See you later. Makoto. Ah, oh, she's so awesome. <sighs> hey, do you have time right now? Sorry for bending so much before. I just wanted to talk about Aiko, but I got a little off topic. Thanks for still pretending to be my boyfriend, too. I don't trust Aiko's boyfriend yet, so can we keep this up until I can make a call one way or another? It's the role I always hoped for. <clears throat> what? Gosh, stop teasing me. I'm counting on you, okay? Let's see how convincing a boyfriend you can be. I'll talk to you later. 
Bye. I'll show you just how much of a convincing boyfriend I am because I'm actually trying to be serious. I mean, what? Ah, you're back. Ah. Uh, hey. By the way, your phone was vibrating. Make sure you check it out, right? Ooh, four messages. Right. Ooh, we got two jobs today. Ooh. She is a uh, rank what? Chihaya. I got a wow. Almost done with almost everything. Fortune. Yeah, she's gonna be rank nine. I need to do the twins. So I'll probably do them off screen today. Yeah, probably. Cause I already have a lot unlocked. All right. Wow, a lot of max. Fumi, Mishima, Maruki. Well, all right. Anyway, I'm gonna leave this episode off here. In the next one, we will probably spend time with Chihaya or any other confidant that might be available. If there are anyone that I'd rather spend my time with. Anyway. Hope you guys have been enjoying these videos. If you have, please leave a like, comment, and share. That always helps out against that pesky YouTube algorithm. Subscribe to join the Moonlight Army today. Hit that bell icon to be notified when I upload a new video. If you guys want to stalk me on my social medias, the links will be in the description box below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. So, take care, guys. Bye-bye.